like the one and only, the incomparable Broadway legend, three-time Tony-winning dancer, singer, and actor, Kennedy Center honoree, I'm running out of breath, Presidential <laughs> Medal of Freedom recipient, Cheetah Rivera. Well, a beautiful <laughs> memoir. Cheetah takes us through her remarkable journey. I, I, so I just listed off in no particular order all of those honors. Is there one Ooh. that confirms I made it? I made it. Oh. <laughs> um, when, when I won um, the Kennedy Center, mm -hmm. uh, I couldn't believe it. You know, I kept saying, <laughs> um, they've made a mistake. I you can have. tell you, I was so surprised, having been a fan your entire career, of how open you were in the memoir about your love life. Um, woo! <laughs> <laughs> Clearly, you are and have always been one of the most beautiful women in the world. Hands up. <laughs> this, I, I mean, it's a, it's, a, it's a weird question to ask in 2023, but did you know the power of your beauty? No. Did uh, not. I, 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 I didn't care about it, except I did. Oh. I mean, there... See, you won't too soon. Yeah. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there, there is an alter ego in that book. Yes. And her name is Dolores. <laughs> and she is the one that made me who and what I am. Mm. Uh, Cheetah, my real name is Dolores Conchita Figueroa del Rivero. And... That gave me goosebumps. <laughs> <laughs> and um, with the help of Patrick Pacheco, um, I, I exposed Dolores. Yeah, yeah. We don't uh, talk about Bruno, but we talk about Dolores. That's okay. right. <laughs> well, you talk about, which struck me, your relationship with the great Sammy Davis Jr., someone yeah. I'm also an incredible fan of. You met in 1956. You were 23. That's right. At the time. Um, Broadway show, Mr. Wonderful. This, the way you describe oh. this relationship. <laughs> Whoa, look at you. <laughs> I was taller than, than, than Sammy. You were taller than Sammy. <laughs> <laughs> she said it, I did not. Um, the show was fully integrated, which was rare at yeah, that right, time. Right. I was a snob uh, at the time. Um, what do you mean by that? Because I can't imagine. Oh, I, 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 Sammy was supposed to do this Broadway show. And I, and I went, well, he's a... He's from nightclubs. Oh. What's he doing in a Broadway theater? <laughs> I mean, he doesn't know from Broadway. Did you tell him that? No. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> no. But the, the first half of the show was the book. Yeah. The second half was Sammy, um, his nightclub act. And... We sat on stage and watched his nightclub act. Wow. And I was, I, I was just blown totally away. I learned so much from watching him. So now you're 90 years old. Oh, my God! I can't believe it. I mean, I cannot believe um, the age. I, um, so I, I don't can't believe want... you just kicked up one leg and one leg. <laughs> I, uh, and what, what is the secret? Because I'm looking at you, and not only, obviously, the exterior is beautiful, but it's, it's coming through, the joy and the fun. What is the... I mean, we're all sitting here. What's the secret? Loving life. Yeah. Being, being, <laughs> being uh, absolutely grateful for your family, yeah. for the people.
people that you've met. You've said your daughter's. Oh, the, my the, daughter. The, the, be, the best production you ever met your daughter. She is the best. And that's, that's Tony Mordegui. Yes. Lisa, your daughter. That's right. That's right. Um, being grateful for all of that. Look at that. I mean, I mean, you're twin. You're twin. And and you were pregnant at such a, a an important time in your career. You were pregnant during West Side's right yeah. before they and they delayed that b before the English production yeah. of West Side. Um, I, 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 I well, Jerry Robbins said during the rehearsals of of uh, West Side that w sharks were not supposed to you know, talk to the jets at all. And uh, what did I do? I married. I married, <laughs> married one and had a baby. And had a baby. <laughs> Just threw the whole storyline off. Oh, totally, totally. But um, <clears throat> I, that I, getting getting back to um, being grateful for your life. Yeah. Um, if this is the only life you've got, yeah. and you've got to. You've got it, and everybody you meet is a teacher. Yeah. Whether it is to do something or not to do yeah. it. Yeah. You know, um, I, I, I'm grateful for, I'm grateful for sitting here with you. Oh, my God.